Whoa, check that out! You guys actually did it! You guys helped me get to 100,000 subscribers! That's 100,000 new OGs that subscribe to the channel! Now I have a new challenge for you! I'm trying to get to 250,000 subscribers, so be sure to hit the like button on this video, subscribe if you haven't, and click that post notification bell for daily videos and weekly live streams. Now I gotta go! Hope you guys enjoyed this video! Yo, okay, we are back with another video, guys. It is your boy T Pro, and today, guys, we are here with another video because today we are going to be specking out one of a brand new Ferrari. Actually, it's not brand new, but there are some cool gaming mechanics that was just added in the brand new Driving Empire update guys that i want to show you and like i said big shout out to uh, driving empire developers for letting me play early in this game i saw the other day guys someone commented like why do i have a second chair i'm gonna be honest um that was my old friend's chair uh when i moved into this office uh he just he, he just had it in here and he never and i i don't think oh he's ever gonna pick it up so i just have it a second chair here so if you guys want a free gaming chair let me know all right so here we go we are in tlr autos uh where we have the brand new dealership here it looks amazing and i have my my koenigsegg right over here i can't open the trunk just yet or the engine bay or nor the front or the front trunk i think that's gonna be in the final release of the game uh, the reason why we can't do that, but you guys can see the interior though. With the double helix or quadrilix, whatever you want to call these doors. Uh, I forgot what the actual name is, but it's like quadrihelix or uh, trihelix or something like that for uh, the Koenigsegg Agera. But this is not the car we're going to be reviewing today. Today, guys, we are going to be checking out the brand new uh, Ferrari convertible mechanics that was added to the game. Yes, we're going to go ahead and get a convertible. Usually, whenever you press on a convertible, it just kind of disappears. But they actually have real moving convertibles in this game now. So we're going to go ahead and get ourselves a Ferrari Spider. We can get this one right here, the 2011 Ferrari Spider, if we wanted to. Uh, let me see if there's another Ferrari that probably would be a, lo a little bit better than that one. Okay, we got ourselves the... Oh, we got the 2021 uh, 812 Superfast right here. Or we have this one. Oh my gosh. This is the Pistol right here. Super nice. Maybe we can try this out. Let's go ahead and buy this one right here. And we'll buy this one as well. Oh, that's super, super nice. I forgot if this was the 812 Super Fast. I might be wrong. But let's go ahead and buy it. But I want to show you guys the brand new convertible uh, mechanics in this game. It's absolutely amazing. And we're going to put a wide body kit on this as well while we're in here. I love how you can just like leave the car right there with the doors open. That's so sick. I love the brand new doors in the game. Okay, let's go ahead and bring these cars right on top. Uh, if you guys haven't checked out my wide body Aventador video, go check that out. The link is going to be in the description down below. We went over every single Aventadors in the game and slapped a wide body kit on it, guys. It was absolutely amazing. I don't think I'm ever going to get tired on these wide body kit mods. These are probably going to be one of the coolest things uh it like ever <laughs> yet in the game so this is gonna be pretty cool so let's check out the ferrari 488 uh spider real quick this is the pista oh you guys can see oh we can open the oh look at this okay so this one we can open the engine bay on it let me get out real quick this one you can open the engine bay oh that's so sick okay let's go ahead and open the door of course the door is a little bit regular uh it's nothing special with ferraris I'm not sure if we can open the front just yet. I think there's are some cars that are still being worked on, uh, but most of them do have functioning doors, but which is super dope. But this is what we're here for, guys. This is the convertible part. Let's see it right now. Oh my gosh! Yo, that's so dope. That is so cool. What? It kind of reminds me of uh, Southwest Florida, guys. Yo, that is so cool. Okay, let's go ahead and get out the other Ferrari, the 812 Super Fast. This one we can open just the doors. But like I said, it's nothing special with Ferraris. They have regular doors, guys. And then let's go ahead and go and open the convertible. Here we go. Oh my gosh. 
That is so dope. We can also drive at the same time while doing it. Ooh, look at that. Someone specked out the Ferrari already. <laughs> that is super nice, man. Okay, let's go ahead and go to the body shop real quick. Let's go ahead and see this in first person as well. I need to see this in first person. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That is so dope. That is absolutely lovely. Wow. <laughs> the interior on this game looks amazing. And let's go ahead and get back to the uh, exterior. We're going to go down the street real quick from the new dealership. And there is a brand new dealership right here. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Where is the entrance? There it is. You guys can see Paradise Tuning where we can bring in our cars. And there is a hot dog. There's a hot dog in the front desk. I got to check this out. What is going on? Is this Nick? Is this List Nick right here? Um, hey. <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> is that Nos? That little Nos? Oh my gosh. That's funny. And you guys can see the shop right here. It looks pretty dope. All we have to do is drive in our car. Uh, we can just go right through it, which is absolutely pretty cool. Uh, we can just go ahead and back up into the dealership or into the, the workshop, really. And I believe our car will latch on automatically. Here we go. Uh, nope, it doesn't latch on. But you know what? It's still pretty cool to have something like this. And your customized menu does pop up too, which is absolutely like realistically cool. <laughs> can we like bring these lifts up? I wish we could, but we can't. So let's go ahead and put the body kit on this 812 super fast. You guys can see we can put a wide body kit on it. And yes, a boom. Whoa, that's so sick. So we can actually, let me see. Uh, let's take it off real quick. And then you guys see the difference of the wide body kit with and without of it on. That is so nice, man. Wow, and performance. Let's go ahead and lower this bad boy. Boom. And then let's go ahead and pop up the menu again so we can stick let's see here a spoiler on it high down for spoiler let's go ahead and buy that Woo, that's that's nice i like that i thought it was gonna be a big one but that's pretty sleek though i like that color i love this car color too it's like a matte red already but i think we're gonna change it up just because we added a, a brand new kit on it you know what i want it white i want it looking clean i know a lot of you guys like the uh, matte color which we're gonna make it matte but we're gonna make it matte white. Look at that. That is so nice. With the orange cal or the yellow calipers. <laughs> that is what's up, guys. With the yellow interior. Let's pop that on. Yeah, let's go. Okay, so as you guys can see, we got ourselves a decked out 812 super fast. Actually, no, I forgot one thing. I need to put some new put some rims on it. We have brand new rims in the game, guys. Uh, so we gotta take that as an advantage. The rims are one of my favorite additions to this game. You guys can see we can preview it too if we don't like it. So you don't have to buy it, which is cool. All right, let's see what we slap on this bad boy. All right, let's see what we can slap on this. Let's see here. Let's see. What about this one? How does this one look? Woo, nice. Not a big fan of it. I don't like two, three pieces, guys. I don't know why. I like just a one piece or even a two piece is cool. But a lot of these uh, are, are, I mean, they're kind of like for the Reiser cars in a way. But the Volca is one of my favorite too. Let's go ahead and get a Vulcan for some reason. Uh, boom. All right, let's go get the Vulcan. And there we go. That is nice. I got to color it, though, because it's kind of looking a little plain. Let's go ahead and give it, uh, like, a bronze rims. Yes. There we go. Look at that. That is sick. That is absolutely sick, man. Amazing. I feel like I got to paint the calipers red just to make it stand out a little bit. There we go. Woo! This is nice. <laughs> oh my gosh. And of course, we got to put the drop top down. Look at this. Oh my gosh. This is so dope, guys. Wow, it is literally raining. Now we got to put the drop top Bruh. back up, guys. What? I just love how you can put the drop top up and down at any speed. Usually, like in real life convertible cars, guys, I've had a convertible car before. And you can't go over like 37 miles per hour. They're very specific with it. Or else it'll literally just like, you know, go back into place. Uh, whatever's closest, up or down. But, you know, we can put the convertible up at any speeds in this game. Which is absolutely amazing. Actually, we can actually, like, leave it like this and open the doors. 
Look at that. Look at that. My Ferrari's getting wet. My Ferrari's getting wet. But this is a cool spec. I love it. Let's go ahead and get the the spider out with the 488 spider pista let's go ahead and pop that out i love the lights on it they kind of dimmed it down a little bit you don't really see the daytime running lights a lot but let's go ahead and change out this car right here not a big fan of the blue and yellow we gotta change that that was kind of look a little tacky here all right let's go ahead and go to the shop and of course we got the convertible baby we got the spider so we can put the seat or the the, the roof down if we wanted to in the shop all right we're gonna back up right here all right sounds amazing sounds amazing and then appearance let's go ahead and change it to we'll give it like a ooh, that's nice maybe we can give it like a red color a nice red color or even a yellow color we already have a yellow car though what about a black one oh that's so nice that is so menacing looking guys oh we can even do matte blue look at that that is so nice oh my gosh but we got to change that secondary color though we could probably do a white one Ooh, that's nice. So we can do a dark blue, the same thing that matches with it. Or even a gray if we wanted to. Oh, the gray is nice. I gotta add the gray in there. And we can put a reflection up on it so we don't. it doesn't have to be matte, but we're gonna make it matte. Let's go ahead and put new rims on this thing. Uh, I like the Vulcan T5. Those are nice. And boom. Ooh, <laughs> those are clean. Those are absolutely clean, guys. Oh my gosh. And you guys can see we have the interior. We can make it white if we wanted to, just to give it a little pop with the rims as well. Wow, this is looking nice. We can even give it yellow calipers, or we can leave it red, but we can leave it yellow as well. But yes, this is it. We got the brand new Pista right here. This is so nice, man. I forgot to lower it. Let's go ahead and lower this thing. Boom, now we got it. And then we got the wide body kits next. Oh, no, we don't have a wide body color in this one, which is unfortunate, but hopefully they'll add it later on in the future. Maybe the other Ferrari has it, which we have to check it out. But this convertible is so nice. You know what? I'm going to have to put the top up because it is raining. So let's go ahead and go back to the dealership and buy the other Ferrari, unless I don't have it already. So we can go ahead and customize it, guys. I'm trying to put, like, wide body kits on all of them. All right, we're back at the dealership. Give me a Ferrari, baby. Give me a Spider right now. Here we go. Let's type in Spider. And then we got the new... Here we go. Let's go ahead and buy this. This is the 488. Or this is the 458. Let's go ahead and buy this. I believe this one has the wide body kit on it as well. All right, here we go. We got the wide body kit on this. As you guys can see, wide body kit on the 458. Oh, that's <laughs> sick. That is sick. And then we got the GT wing or we got the duck spoiler wing, which is not that big. Uh, you guys can see it's just a duck spoiler. And then, uh, or a duck tail, sorry. Uh, and then we got the GT3, which is absolutely amazing. Kind of looks like the Liberty Walk now. Uh, a Ferrari. That's so cool. And then we got calipers. Uh, we can actually make it like a, a, a matte gray. I kind of like the matte gray look to these cars for some reason. Kind of like a military green. Oh, that's so sick, man. That is so sick. We can lower this thing, too. We can lower this bad boy. Woo-wee! <laughs> that is so nice. Oh, my God. All right, we got to add some different rims to this, too. We got to add maybe... Uh, we'll add one of these. We'll see how these look. The Vortex. There we go. Look at that. My brake caliper is like sticking out. <laughs> my brake pads are sticking out, guys. Oh my gosh. Ooh, I like these Forge P2s right here. Yes. Let's go ahead and buy the Forge P2s. And then we can make it, uh, we can make it like a black color to make it look a little bit menacing. Oh, that's so nice. Look at this. And it's a convertible, too. Look at that. Ooh. <laughs> Let's go, man. I can't wait to go cruising with you guys. Like, literally, just go down the street cruising like this out of all of them i think this one is the coolest looking one right here oh my gosh we got an aventador right there with the wide body kit this is absolutely amazing guys wow <laughs> we got a a wide body uh huracan right there we need to do a, another spec like that my boy's gonna go cruising with me look at him <laughs> This is so dope, man. If you guys enjoyed this video and you guys want to see more Ferrari mods or any other car mods in the game, guys, let me know in the comments down below. 
This is absolutely fun to make, guys. This game is actually getting really great. And thank you guys so much for the support so far. You've been giving my videos. Uh, like, honestly, it's been a, a journey so far, uh, especially going towards the end of the year from 20K to uh, 200,000 subscribers, guys. Uh, it's absolutely crazy. So thank you guys so much for that. But this is it for today's video. If you guys want to see more, let me know in the comments down below. Hit that like button, subscribe for more, and click that post notification bell. And uh, while you guys are watching this video, I'll give you guys a little bit of uh, more insights. This is the Driving Empire a brand new update that's coming out uh, next week. I don't know exactly when next week, um, but I'll let you guys know that it is coming pretty soon. It's been in the making for the very longest time. And a lot of you guys, I, saw, I read a lot of comments, a lot of you guys don't like it. But I'm gonna be honest with you, the mechanics of the game has improved so much. Like, you, you can go like super fast in this game without even having to worry about bumps anymore. And the map looks absolutely great. It's beautiful, it's brand new. And I know it's not the old Wayport map like we used to play, but this thing is absolutely great, guys. You're gonna absolutely love it. And the mechanic is just so amazing. And the new camera movement as well, guys. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys have a great day. And peace out.